Good morning, guys, from Epcot once again. Today is day three of the 2024 Marathon Weekend Dopey Challenge Edition. It is the half marathon today. Now, I do have to say this half marathon course is revised. So it is supposed to rain today. So late last night, uh, they decided to revise the course. They have taken six miles off of the course. So um, instead of going to Magic Kingdom, they've cut off all of Magic Kingdom. We're going up the highway and then we're turning around and coming back. So we pretty much have like five straight miles of highway and then two and a half miles of Epcot and then half a mile of Epcot parking lot and then we're done. Um, so they did modify it. It is seven miles instead of 13. Um, and then they're closing the course at seven because then it's just a thunderstorm. So this happens frequently. Um, if, you've, if you're a frequent flyer here, it does happen. Um, people get really upset about it. I feel horrible for the people who are running the half because a lot of them do it for the castle picture and now Magic Kingdom's cut off. So I feel really bad for those people, but that also gives them motivation to like do Dopey again so that that doesn't happen and you get two chances to do all of this. But anyway, we're gonna see how this goes. I'll probably get in those extra six miles as well just to get the 48.6 mileage in the end. Not that it matters because we went all over the place yesterday. I don't even know what my mileage was yesterday, but I've made up those miles elsewhere this week. But just for my own brain, probably still get those out somehow. All right, here's the finish line. We should, as long as we don't have any injuries or anything, should not be a problem getting back to that today. But tomorrow is the big day. So I just met up with Kristen's Dopey Song group for our group costume that we did. Um, Amanda is in the corral already sitting down. And um, I'm gonna go use the restroom real quick and then I'm gonna go find her. She is at the front of Corral C. So we're gonna get up there. We're gonna try to do our best getting through this nice and early. And we're closing the course at 7 a.m. So everybody has to be done by then, which shouldn't really be a problem. Um, it'll be okay for us. So, all right, here we go. This has been insane. It was a medical emergency in Corral C, which we are in, and they didn't, they couldn't let us go. So we literally just ran from our corral to here, and now they're gonna immediately release us. So crazy. It is very, very, very windy. Oh my goodness. This is like an hour long line. I'm not gonna lie. I would absolutely, absolutely wait in that line for Merlin if I knew I was gonna, if I knew I wasn't gonna get swept. Here's my one. Hercules according to the list that I've got and I can see them. This is pretty cool. Here's mile three. How will you can see that? Okay guys, now before anybody panics if we see the balloons here. These runners are over three miles behind us. So we were kind of hoping maybe we'd catch a glimpse of the balloons here, but I'm not seeing them actually, believe it or not. They just started a couple minutes ago, what, maybe five? 
five, ten minutes ago. So I thought maybe we'd catch a glimpse of them coming over this overpass, but I'm not seeing them. So all, all those lights up there, the sweet buses following. And those poor balloons, I don't even know if you can see them. The wind is blowing so hard, it's like on the ground. It's that far behind her. That's gotta be like, I mean, that's not helping your pace to have that drag it behind you like that, but they're there. I don't know if you guys, can you see them bouncing around? I feel so bad for them. Go Nancy, go, and whoever's with you. I feel for you today. They're super sweet, by the way. I've done a dead last start with them before. Um, they are really awesome. Then here, I guess these are our runners that must have just started a little bit late. And then all the bikers that you can see here. And then you've got these sweet buses and then the police behind the sweet buses just controlling traffic. So, there they are. Now we've got Moose U. Pocahontas and Miko. Mile six. And we have one final mile left of this makeshift half marathon. And it is starting to rain a little bit. So hopefully everybody's able to clear the course in time before things get too rough. And hopefully we make it back to the car. No trash can ban today. It's the first time I've never seen them here. Check this out guys, this is about 0.3 away from the finish line and they, they have a sweep bus. They are going to sweep people with 0.3 left to go to the end. When they, they tell you, the when people tell you, you get to Epcot and you are safe. Did they come in? This choir, <laughs> they never hold back. They are still going. We are, you good. We are soaked out here. Uh, can you see like the rain on Amanda's backpack? We are soaked. The balloon ladies are still like three miles behind us. So I'm guessing, I'll have to let you guys know, but I'm guessing they're gonna rope the course off and sweep everybody at a certain point, or they've already done it, I'm not sure. Woo, guys, this is absolutely insane. You guys see just how disgusting it is out here? We're wet, our shoes are soaked, my feet are soaked, everything is soaked. And people are still coming in. You're headed to the end of the fall, you're looking for your personal vehicle, any ride chair services, a lot. or a good vehicle. Oh my gosh, guys, check this out, okay. Seven, it's about 7.09 right now, and at 7.07ish, they announced that they're sweeping pretty much everybody off the course. And look at us. This is absolutely Thank you. Uh, I appreciate that. I'll be doing both. I'll be putting my microphone down and heading out there. Ooh, guys, this is absolutely insane. You guys see just how disgusting it is out here? We are wet, our shoes are soaked, my feet are soaked, everything is soaked. People are still coming in. You are headed to the end of the fall. You are looking for your personal vehicle. Any ride chair services. A lot. Or a good vehicle.